Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of RTHD. In this episode, I just got this in the mail. So stay tuned as we get to the unboxing. All right, guys, so we're back and this is... Oh, this is something, something, something good that is used for some, hopefully, good cinematic technology um, and so forth to give you good footage and so forth. So, without further ado, let's get to this. And we have something here from Andua. Okay, I hope that's how you pronounce it. Andua, Andua. And there we go, guys. I have been waiting for nearly a month for this thing. Oh. Uh, as you can see, it looks like something with three wheels on it and uh, so forth. If you uh, already have any... Um, what's, your, what's the word I'm looking for? If you have any idea about this, um, don't spoil it for others, all right? But uh, let's start to get this thing open. I think I might be dropping my frames a little bit here. Wow, sweet. Comes with a manual. It says the Andua PPL 06S Pro Electronic Moving Dolly from Andua. Right, cool. Not like we actually read these things, right? <laughs> okay, so as you can see, it comes with a remote, which is nice. Um, this says that it was advertised as a 2.4 gigahertz remote. This was going for, I believe, 60 dollars um i'm talking about the total product here this goes for 60 us on amazon but it's really really hard to find you actually have to go to andor's uh shopping uh shop pretty much and uh you, you you might be able to find it there all right so this is a 2.4 gigahertz one so this should uh the remote so this should be uh a, you could actually control this thing remotely right so um with some distance using this thing that's why it's 2.4 gigahertz all right so what we have in the box is of course the actual device which looks kind of like a car right yeah okay and it comes with some extra stuff here it comes with like like extra uh, extra like the wheels those wheels those plastic wheels and it comes with three different types of it's like uh, these allen wrenches i think that's what they call them either way we have also in here a mobile phone holder so we'll get to what that does you could probably have a look at it on the side. This is what it looks like from the side. Kind of cool, right? Nice. And pretty much it's a motorized slider slash dolly. Oh, it comes with a, a charging port cable. And we see it seems to be micro USB. So that's nice as well. And what else? And a battery. Hmm. So, okay. So they have the instructions on the battery. So we'll get to that. And lastly... In the box it comes with what seems to be some sort of an adapter to hold on to what I believe might be this piece here so I you know, screw on and then screws here but we're gonna get to all of that in a few minutes all right so that's what in the, that's what is in the box and let's get to actually I'm really working on this thing okay sorry about the noise all right mm-hmm so you have a pretty, pretty short cable. I don't know how you would actually charge this with a short cable, but um, we'll see how that goes. It's <laughs> really short, like one foot in length. Um, I mean, for the, I don't know, the price of this thing. It does feel actually quite sturdy. It feels like solid iron. Um, it's about less than a pound, maybe like half a pound, a little bit more than half a pound. I I were to average. And it comes with this battery, so I believe, I see something here with... Uh, it says, please charge the dolly before first time using. All right, so the English isn't perfect, but it's not bad. Um, so let's see. Oh, you can actually, okay, so there's there's a cap here on the side. If you can see that, there's a cap here on the side to open. And the difference is this side has a, a bigger cap. This side doesn't have a cap. So that's how you know to put in the battery that way. So we're not screwing it. Yep, cool. And there is a f totally flat large piece and a little bit pointed piece. Not really that much pointed. As you can see, flat. So I guess that's the bottom. This is probably the top. And it shows you which way to put this thing in. So I'm guessing it just fits in there like that. That's it. Wow. Very small battery. And we 
me screw that back in. That's supposed to be a rechargeable battery, by the way. So you never have to really open this up unless the battery is bad. Then you'll have to change the battery. But yeah, guys, so this is the Andua. Um, I'm, I'm sure it's probably not charged because they said, please charge your battery. So I probably won't be able to demonstrate it right away. But I'll have to post-produce this video, obviously, because of that. So... Um, hopefully you get to see that as well too. All right, so this part is actually the part that you Now there's different pieces here as you can see and uh, you pretty much screw in Wherever you want uh, your camera or your phone or whatever to be set so there's really two spots that you could screw in this um, To get the camera this camera point here that you would like all right, and um, the nice thing is actually has a hole so you could put in something to, to crank it out when you have to crank it back out So you could tighten this as tight as possible um, Which is great and you pretty much after that you put your phone in Your phone adapter or whatever this phone holder so to speak and Now that you have that in you can actually use this to put your phone in like this and I think this speaks for itself but pretty much this thing is gonna roll and record what you're doing so that's pretty cool and pretty much allows you to get really really smooth footage um, now of course it's not only your, for your phone though that's what they, they provide you with a phone um, this phone piece the phone holder um, you can actually of course put maybe even a DSLR on top of this thing. This thing is really really I mean, it's it's it doesn't seem that it's gonna shake or move over. It's definitely it's very very sturdy now one of the other things that's really really nice about this um, Andua is Actually actually this part which is the part that you adjust um, so you adjust this uh, in and it's up to 180 degrees obviously as you can see here and this allows it to actually move in the direction you want it to move. So, if you wanted to move, obviously, uh, if you wanted to move in that direction, you go this way, and it would. It's pretty much doing turning for you. So I'll get to the demonstrations as I do actual recordings and so forth. But this is really the ander. And um, the nice thing is, it comes as I said with this remote, so you can actually remote control this thing. You don't have to actually. You know push it or anything it actually has a motor motorized motor and you can actually remote control it and um, of course on the side here as you can see there's a port to charge there's a what seems to be a light a LED light to tell you whether it's on or off I wonder if it actually has um, this is the, this is the motorized one wow this motorized one can't even move at all and this one could move all right and this one could move yeah um, uh, to, you can actually adjust the direction so whether you want it to go forward or backward, that's there. You can actually um, increase the speed or decrease the speeds, plus or minus, and of course the power button as well. So you can actually control that from the device itself. So that's kind of that's nice as well. Um, but you could do all of that with this. So we'll probably get into a demonstration um, in the next video where I'll have to go through demonstration stuff. Um, with that being said, I'm just curious to see whether this thing has a battery uh, would charge. Oh wow! Oh, it's making. It's actually, it's actually moving, guys, guys. This thing is moving. Watch, check it out, check it out. Oh my goodness! Holy cow! It's moving. But <laughs> it's, it's actually, it's actually sliding. So I don't know why does. I don't know why the driver. Oh, it's because it's 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 moving sideways because it can't actually grip on this material. So um, let's try. Let's try it without this material. Let's see what happens. Let's see if it actually will roll. Nice. So it actually does smooth movement, and that's the whole idea behind it. So we'll see how that actually works out. Um, in our next video where I'll actually try to record the footage and so forth. I have no idea how to stop it But uh, I guess you could re let me see what reverse reversing You can hear a very light noise, but that's not bad 
I wonder if that is the slowest. I can't actually tell if that's the slowest. Because it doesn't have a gauge to tell you whether it's slow or not. Um, let's change back the direction. So this might be the slowest one. And so when your camera is here and you're looking at the feature, you'll see how it looks like. All right, so that's being said. Um, thank you so much for viewing, and uh, let's see if I can get some other footage as we go along with that. Thanks. Make sure to like and subscribe as well as we go along.